In this video, we're going to take a look at how to create a mask in DaVinci Resolve. Now, I think this is the quickest and best way to do it. There's project files in the description if you want to edit along with me. Now, let's get into it. So, we're going to have this text appear from behind the tree. So, to do this, you're going to want to grab a text layer and drag it over your background layer. Uh, in our case, we're going to just make it say relax. Goes with the theme of the video. Make it nice and pretty. And then after that, you're going to want to go ahead and copy your background and place it over the text. You can do this easily by hitting Alt and dragging the clip up. So now we're going to go to the Color tab and select the Window icon. From there, you can grab the Pen tool and begin drawing our mask. If you need to move your preview window, you can hold Control in the scroll wheel and just use the scroll wheel to zoom in and out. Once you do that, you're going to go ahead and start creating your mask. You can do this by just clicking and drawing. The more zoomed in you get and the more fine details you add, the cleaner the mask will be. In our case, we're just going to do something rough. You don't have to do the whole tree because our text is only interacting with part of it. Now you're just going to want to connect the mask back to the start and there you go. You cut out a little section. To make this visible, you're going to want to right click on your node layer and select add alpha output. Pretty much what an alpha layer is, is it's going to make anything that we cut out of the mask be an invisible layer. So now just connect the two nodes and there you go, you can see our text pop up. Now let's head back to the edit page and if we disable this track, you can see there's our mask and now you can adjust the text and it's going to go behind that mask. So now we're just going to set keyframes, one at the start and one where we want it to end. And you can see the text is going to pop out. If you guys enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please subscribe, leave a like and comment for what you want to see next. Um, check out all the links in the description. I've got clips for you to edit and other things to check out. Thanks, guys.